go to the lost and found. Don't you want your stuff back? I'll turn in box tops to your advisory period, teacher only. February 28th is the deadline for the current contest. Top two classes in each grade will win a popcorn party. January 30th is the last day to purchase a yard book. No, a yard book. No, a yearbook. The next day for Brook and Movie Club meets on Wednesday, January 28th, A Little Princess. When you, what do you have to do? Get the book and read it. Fill out the book report sheet on the back of this paper and a permission slip. You must do this each month. You can find it in the library. My precious! <laughs> Hey guys, it's Nick with sports. Uh, the Packers and the Cowboys played on Sunday, and the Packers smoked the Cowboys. They won, and they're going to the Super Bowl. This is Tinsley, and she wrote a letter to the Gratitude Foundation, and now she's going to read it. Michaela, she's not only my big sister, but my best friend. No matter what a situation is or how bad it is, she always helps me. She is one of the main reasons I'm so close to God. She always has a smile when she's upset and sees someone upset. She always cheers them up. She's always loving, caring, kind, compassionate, and most of all, she will always be my best friend. Ever since she left for college, we barely talk. Lately, we've talked a lot more. If I ever hear the name Michaela, I always think of a strong, faithful, smart girl. She has always been my number one supporter. She always tries to make it to my events, either it's basketball, volleyball, drill team, cheer, or track. She has always tried, and at the same point, and at some points, she has let me down, but she's always made up for it. She will always be there, be a supporter, be kind when people are down, and always love you. Even though she's eight and a half years older, she's the best friend I have ever had. Michaela is one of those people where she doesn't care what people think of her. She doesn't care what people think of her because she doesn't like people. Wait, what? She doesn't like... Oh, she doesn't care about what people think of her. Because about... What? Being rude about it. <laughs> she always helps me with my schoolwork and practices and my games and my problems and most of all, just my old life will do. She will, always, she will always help me with my faith or school or with any troubles because she's a kind and caring. She will always be my number one best friend and nothing will change that at all. I can't, that one word cheers me up. One person to look forward to, that one day I see her is all I want. In 2013 through 2014, Texas Tech University had given 882 degrees, including undergraduate, master's, and doctoral. Uh, See ya! Bye! Peace the box office. Today we're going to be talking about a game called the Crossy Road. And um, it's a really fun game where you just have this little character and you can go forward, sideways, go anywhere you'd like to do it. Make sure you don't get hit by a car. What do you think about this game? Well, uh, it is pretty fun. Uh, you you are you get a little character and then you jump uh, over, like you jump to avoid cars, jump forward to avoid cars, and try to get as high as you can. And I would rate it a five out of five. And make sure you don't stay in one place or this hawk's gonna come and get you. And I will read this uh, 5 out of 5 too. This is box office. See you next time. Welcome to the Patriots. This is a teacher interview, and we're interviewing Mr. Riley, and this is Faith, Taylor, and Madison. Can you see me? Yes. What college did you go to? I went to Prairie View a and University. What do you enjoy most about? What do I enjoy most about teaching? I enjoy students, I enjoy working with wonderful staff here, and I think all of the Club Fridays, that's pretty awesome. What's your favorite karate move? My favorite karate move? There's so many. But I really enjoy punching. Could I demonstrate what a punch is? Oh gosh. You want me to demonstrate a punch? 
Is that what you would like? Yeah!